translating words into algebraic expressions. I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will try to understand how to write algebraic expressions when we are dealing with currency. So first we have our let statement. It says Anil has n nickels and d dimes. So, so here we have defined the number of nickels which Anil has is n and number of dimes is d. Now the question is translate the following statements into algebraic expressions. The first one is the value of nickels in cents. As you know nickel is 5 cents and if you have n nickels then the value will be 5 times n. Right? So that becomes the value of nickels in cents. Part B is value of dime in dollars. So dollars is 10 cents, dimes is 10 cents. Now 10 cents means 0 0.10 dollars, right? So in dollars, this will be 0 0.10. And since there are d number of dimes, we have 0 0.10 d. That represents the value of all these dimes in dollars. Then we have total value of the coins in cents. Remember, the units are very important. We are saying total value of coins. How many coins do we have? We have n nickels and d dimes. So the total value is how much? So for the nickels in cents, it is 5 cents. So we write 5n plus in dimes we have 10 cents. So 10d, right? So that becomes the value for these coins in cents. Part D is total number of coins. Total number of coins is n plus t. The number of nickels plus the number of dimes. So that is how we can translate the given statements relating currency into algebraic expressions. So go through it once again. It will help you to solve linear systems involving money. I hope that helps. Thank you.